Hi everybody, this is me again for Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. How's it? So today we're ready to press on in uh, this building. I think that this is actually the last of the Rocket Brothers. Who the hell are they? Seriously, who are they? You have a goal, man? Well, I have a Tsukasa, so let's go ahead and start them off with Confusion. Die. Haha! <laughs> and about to use a Drowsy, so let's go ahead and bring in Hatsune, get Hatsune a little action. Leech Life! Do a ton of damage with a weak attack. <laughs> Damn, that did do a lot of damage. Kill the fucker in one hit. And I'm about to use a Hypno, so for Hypno, we're gonna bring in Freya. Haha. -ha. And kill it. Um. Okay. Warg brothers, you lost. Well, you were facing Megarin Luca. Okay, so actually, if you went that direction, you wouldn't be able to get anywhere. Uh, so let's go ahead and come back. Rest up. This is actually the way you need uh, you need to go. If you come back over this, uh, come back to this teleporter, we actually missed one, and we missed it intentionally. This teleporter right here actually takes us to where we need to go, and that son of a bitch. Okay, <clears throat> so let's go ahead and bring a sphere up front. No, they didn't. You saw me in Saffron? Well, I didn't see you in Saffron. Why didn't you want to fight? I could use the experience. And you have a Pidgeot. Well, I have an Sphere. Rollout! Now, the reason I'm using Rollout as opposed to Spark is because... Why not save the power points? I mean, we don't absolutely need them, especially for the next Pokemon. Seriously. Haha. -ha. I mean, knock out two Pokemon with the use of one PowerPoint. <laughs> Even if our attack power is down, Rollout's still gonna do an obscene amount of damage. Haha. -ha. Die. Leave a spear in and finish out rollout. <laughs> okay, now I got three Pokemon with the use of one PowerPoint. That's even better. Sweet. And about to use an Alakazam, new Pokemon, I do believe. For Alakazam, we're going to be bringing in uh, Hatsune, Psychic-type, uh, psychic the evolved form of Abra and Kadabra. Really strong, by the way. I really like Alakazam. Normally, if I take a Psychic Pokemon, it's Abra for Alakazam. Because not only is Alakazam really fast, but really offensive in terms of special attack and defensive in terms of special defense. Alakazam is a very, very good Pokemon. Oh, shit. He's bringing in Charizard. So, we're going to be withdrawing Hatsune. Yeah. Withdraw Hat... No! Withdraw Hatsune in favor of Freya. Haha. <laughs> Ow. Okay, start you off with Surf. 
Oh, and by the way, Charizard, I do believe, is a new Pokemon. I don't think we experienced it. The evolved form of Charmander and Charmeleon. Um, I don't necessarily like it too much because, yes, it's offensive, sure, but it's also more well-balanced. It doesn't have any major strengths, doesn't have any major weaknesses, except for its type. It's type t combination. You can actually take it out really easy with uh, with the rock type move. I mean, really easy. As you can see, it actually did de <laughs> did deal an obscene amount of damage to Freya. But again, I don't fear Charizard at all. Okay, you're not gonna show off how strong your Alakazam is. Normally by this time my Alakazam is so strong I can kick ass and take names with just him, even other psychic types. Yes, he's that strong. Sweet. Uh, no. I've been seeing that since we began this over a year ago. Let's talk to this lady. No, yes I did. Uh, okay, I get a Lapras. Uh, Lapras is actually a... I don't like Lapras. Ice water type, um, really slow. Packs, uh, packs a wallop on the, off, uh, on the uh, hit points in, but other than that, really nothing too spectacular. It's male, so let's go ahead and name him... Um, Ivan, why not? It's not gonna be used. Well, we already have one that does that. Oh, and by the way, offensively, in terms of, um, oh, first I wanna change my lead Pokemon. In terms of special, yes, Lapras does have a better, uh, stand a better advantage than, uh, than uh, Freya, but again, it's just too high level. If we got it at about level 10, I would swap him out uh, for offense uh, at times. But again, it's not that strong. Okay, we got a Cubone, and we're bringing out Ragnarok. So let's start him off with strength. I'm not gonna go over it again. I just don't like focus energy. Especially if you're a first form Pokemon taken out in two turns. And I'm about to use the Drowsy, so let's bring in Henry, get everybody some action today. Nah. Well, it works. Not the attack I wanted to use, but it works. <laughs> and Marowak. Um, for Marowak, let's bring in... Ah, Freya. She loves up. She levels up slower than anybody. Water pulse. Ha ha. Um. So you're begging for mercy, huh? Okay, so it's back here. I'm gonna go ahead and take a quick. I'm gonna go back, rest up my Pokemon for the next fight. I will see you all on the other side. All right, I'm back. Now we're ready to press on. Let's go ahead and change our change. And uh, let's, yeah, let's change our leader to Freya. Hey, it's you. It's Giovanni. Experience a world of pain. Okay, who's got my Glock? And you send out a Nidorino. I've got a Freya. Let's start you off with Dragon Rage. You still have Poison Sting. Okay, uh, <laughs> how the hell do you still survive? And you still have Fury Attack? 
Well, no one, I'm gonna kick your ass. And I'm about to use a Rhyhorn, so let's go ahead and bring in a Tsukasa. Make quick work of this Rhyhorn. Yeah, we could always use Hatsune, but there's more Pokemon here for Hatsune to have fun with. Plus, Rhyhorn just doesn't have a great special defense. Haha! -ha, now it's even worse. <laughs> I'm about to use a Kangaskhan. So for Kangaskhan, let's bring in Ragnarok. And beat the crap out of it. What the? Okay. Okay, die already. And a Nido Queen. So for Nido Queen, let's bring Sukasa back in. Make quick work of this little bitch. Double kick isn't doing much damage. <laughs> More psychic. It still didn't kill it. Ow. Oh shit. Okay, let's see if we can get confusion off. Oh good, it didn't use body slam again. Ugh. Sweet. Well, yeah, you did. But then again, did you expect anything different? You were dealing with Megari and Luca. Alright. Um, okay. A Master Ball! Uh, hold on to that! Don't use it! You will only have one! It will catch any Pokemon without fail. You will only have one. Hold on to it! Okay, so... Let's go ahead and dig into our bag. No. Ah, there's our escape rope. Okay, so let, now let's see what the locals have. It always was. All you needed was a Pokemon, and it's not like they uh, they would have challenged you to a fight if you didn't. Well, you should have flown here earlier. I mean, my Pidgeot would have gotten me uh, gotten me there 20 minutes ago. So now we can actually go into the real Saffron, uh, Saffron City Gym, but we're not going to yet. We need to rest up. Yes. Now let's make our way to the Saffron City Gym. The real Saffron City Gym, this one right here. So it's about here, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode. Coming up next time, we start our trails in the Saffron City Gym. That's what's actually kind of confusing. Oh, and by the way, this is the gym where Hatsune is going to be the most useful. I will see you all on the other side. Hasta lasagna.